Well, a new state mandate could hamper the ability of an area county to respond to a hazardous spill. Our Charlotte Ames joins us with more on the problem. Charlotte. John, the Pennsylvania Emergency Management Agency, Pima, has ordered hazmat teams across the state to upgrade their equipment to maintain their current certification. Now, that would be an expensive endeavor for Blair County's hazmat crew. This trailer houses the command center for Blair County's hazmat team and some of its equipment, but not a spectrometer to quickly identify chemicals or a detector powerful enough to identify materials in parts per billion. Without them, after next year, the team would not be allowed to handle hazardous situations where the type of chemical is unknown and that would limit their ability to respond. I think we would do everything that we uh that we could possibly do to help um, fix a problem or mitigate a situation uh, as safely as we could. Mike Tofano says fortunately Blair County doesn't have too many hazmat calls, but... Unfortunately, we do have a lot of hazardous materials that, that flow through Blair County, both on rail and on, on road. So uh, the potential for, for a call like this is certainly, uh, certainly there. And Tofano estimates that it'll cost Blair County fifty to eighty thousand dollars to buy the extra equipment. Charlotte Ames, WTAJ News.